How's it going, everybody? And welcome back to the channel. In this video, we'll be taking out the T-54. But before I get too far into the T-54, I'm going to mention, I'm sorry for, I was going to say, I'm sorry for not posting uh, any videos really last week, or potentially probably the beginning of this week. Um, I've been, I, most people took off for uh, Thanksgiving. I wasn't planning on it, but as you can tell by my voice, I kind of sound funny. At least I think I do, and, and my brother says I do, so I'm so my mom. Uh, I've been sick, really, really sick. Um... Yeah, it, it's I, I, I've been unable to record because it's either I'm coughing all the time or I lose my voice and I'm st still haven't fully gotten it back. But uh, <clears throat> so hopefully, hopefully we can record because I, you know, record videos and stuff like that because I'm, I'm feeling a little bit better. So hopefully, hopefully it won't be too bad. If you still hear a cough every once in a while, I apologize. If my voice sounds funny, I apologize. But I can't stay away from uh, recording too much longer because I'm a week be over weeks, a couple weeks behind now. And yeah, I, I used I went, you know, I posted all my, uh, I had a couple of, you know, a bunch of like Shadow of War videos left over and. I'm like, oh, this be. I usually get sick for a couple days, you know. I'll get back to recording soon, and bam, a week later, I'm still feeling like crap, and now I need to record videos, still feeling like crap. <laughs> but uh, anyways, before you know, without, don't want to dwell too much on uh, being sick. So before this video gets too long, we're gonna jump back into talking about the tanks. In this video, we're taking out number five for or number four for the Russians. Sorry, I'm bad at numbers. Number four for the Russians, which is the T-54, and it actually supposed to be the 51. But I, on my account, don't have the 51. And my brother does, which that's why my his account does have the 51. But unfortunately, he does not have the heat FS round, which is the only reason why it makes it really, or the actually the good AP, HEBC round or APCBC round. So that's really the only thing that makes it different from the T5449. So right now, I might as well run the T5449 since he does have, for the most part, fully upgraded, and he does have the Sabo round. So I'm hoping we'll, we'll do a little Sabo, try that out, and see what that's like. But for the most part, actually, here back to that. I'll be running the APCBC round, which is this round right here, which is 240 pen. Uh, it's got good fragmentation. It's good. It's reliable round. It's more accurate round than like the APHE and APHEBC. Um, so that's the round we're mainly running. Uh, so uh, we'll go cover the armor here quick a little bit, uh, just just briefly. 100 millimeters, 100 or 200. You know, it's it's durable, but it's not quite strong because you know it's like right down here. You can get pen pretty easily. That's why I have to cover the armor better in this one because I've never done a T54 video. Anyway, so we have about 80 on the side. 155 on the side of the turret, so it actually, I've noticed it's, it's sometimes you shoot right there and it gets kind of wonky and the bullet doesn't pan even though you punch more than 175, but because uh, it does widen out right there, and it is because it's probably heavy angled, so that's, that's a good reason. Um, <clears throat> our top of our tank is decently thick, so it should actually hold up to, you know, at distance like 50 cals and 20 mils. It, it should be too kind of hard to pen us. Um, but yeah, I mean, if you angle yourself, not too much because it seems like this thing has this bug where if you pen the these guards right here that it goes automatically goes in so angle yourself just slightly with this one and keep your front of your turret kind of just keep your turret moving if you can which the turret rotation is actually only 7.8 degrees per second so that's not very good um, but other than that the armor actually is very well considered if this thing was fully upgraded the mobility is actually pretty good you do have a th uh, 431 mile an hour top speed and so it, it, I mean that's why these things do pretty well um, in my experience I'm going against them they do pretty well playing my T5447 uh, I, I don't do very well, but that's partially the reason why, and I'm warning you now, this video may not be the greatest because I don't play well in the Russian tanks. I'm just not a huge fan of the Russian tanks. I don't really like the way they look, and I don't really have any effort, you know, goal to, for researching anything. So I haven't been making that much effort into these things. I'm going to start researching the T-62 for my brother quick because that's what he wants really bad. Um, so, yeah, I mean, uh, the gameplay is probably not going to be the greatest if I get lucky. Great. Uh, other than that, you know, it might be... It might be a lot of me screwing up because I'm just not used to the no depression and things. So, just letting you know now. Anyways, it's got negative four depression. It's got a good 9.9 .9 second reload rate. I think my brother's crew is actually fairly upgraded in the slot it's on. Um, it's a 7.7, and I was gonna do the T5447 because it was at a 7.3 when I made the, the video for it coming out and saying, you know, that that was number four. But uh, being the fact that they've upped it recently back into a 7.7 again, I think it's no different than I might as well run the T5449 or the 51. And uh, so that's why we're doing that. And personally, I don't really like the looks of the 47. I don't like the the tracks look funny, and the turret looks funny, and the the the, the, the 51 and the 49 look so much better. Might be the 51's the best. That's not the right one. The 51's the best with that bubble turret like that. But 49 will we'll make it work. You know, it's it's not too bad. It's got the signature Russian log on it at all times. But uh, yeah, I guess that that's gonna do it for the gameplay part of it. I guess I will see you guys in the. Uh, well, wait, wait, sorry, wait, I screwed that up. That was it for, the, I can't do, I, apparently the sickness has gone to my head. <clears throat> that, that was it for the commentary part of it, and now we're jumping into the gameplay part of it. I will see you there before I screw up any more words. Bye. <laughs>
And here we are in Japan, Domination. I have a spot I like to sit that doesn't really need depression because I'm sitting on an angled hill. Hopefully that works out for me. Um, I'm going to run an AP, or APCBC for the most part to begin with here because I think that's the best for them. Hopefully, hopefully people go this way I'll be getting side shots. But if it turns out we're going to need to, you know, start shooting through the front of people that I might not be able to pen like King Taggers and stuff like that. Unless I can get an easy cheek shot. But then I'll be switching to Sabo and trying that Sabo out. I'm hoping... The only reason I like Sabo and the British is because of the fast reload rate. You can fall up with a good shot before crew really switches. And I don't think 9.9 .9 second reload is not that great. <clears throat> compared to like the British is like down to like 7 and stuff. So it might not be as... Might not be as useful. Um, so one can only hope. Most people like pushing up right away, and I feel like that gets you into a tricky situation. And I like sitting on a hill over here. And MBTs are ready. MBT's reload's kind of insane. <laughs> it's like a 105 millimeter machine gun. I think I see a tank. I don't know. Maybe not. It might have been a rock. Fortunately, the way this map is lined out. People can get to a hill right there easily, and they get on the other side of there, <clears throat> and they can pretty much dominate most of our people trying to go to A. And uh, it most most of the time it doesn't work. You know, we end up like dying right away. And nobody's going the way I was hoping they'd go. That is a oh, there's an MBT. Stay there, dude. No, it's an STRV. And he's down! As we're skirping down the hill. <laughs> and my reload's not great, but... Our victory is near. Makes up with that great fragmentation. Okay, the MBT's right there. I wonder if I could sneak up and hit him. Even with bad potato depression. Nope, I can't. Oh, and you got my driver, really? How did he turn to me so fast? We bounced it. Should be back before. We can fire again. Okay, we won't we won't be popping out again. Where is he exactly? I'm not really sure. He's fake directly that way. He's got about this rock, isn't he? And just get just ready enough. Another one? Centurion Mark 3. Okay, that guy's dead. I don't think the other guy knows I'm here, so I'm gonna move up and try to take him. Driver only, what was that? Oh, they got a barrel. Should we try going for it anyways? Nope. Something's got heat. It's full of heat. Another MBT. Not oh, the Mark 10. He's penning us very easily. We're bouncing a lot of shots, though. It's not going so bad. <clears throat> I'm hoping once I have my tracks repaired, I can pat roll back down, but I don't think it's going to work. Oh, you got us. Hopefully he has a backup. I think that gave me enough points to get a backup, right? What do you pass actually first? Is Hesh? Oh, he hit that cheek right there. That was actually kind of a, that was a lucky shot. We have a backup 49. We'll take it. And especially since for the most part, I should have just came back in like the 51. Because at this point, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I think that was the Century Mark 10 that just died right there. We're going to go towards B now. Hopefully... I don't have to cut everything I'm saying off right now, because I, I, if I don't do anything, I'm probably just going to cut this part of the video off and do a separate chunk. I kind of want to get a plane kill. Wouldn't that be kind of cool? I think it would. I like the looks of T-54s, and they were a very practical tank in real life. But, by the time the T-62 came out, it's like, okay, it's still kind of cool, it's still very practical. The T-72 came out, okay, it's like, you're getting a little long in the tooth, dude. It's getting to be a little, uh, dated. Then the T-92 came out, it's like, okay, you just, I mean, you'll never beat an Abrams. 
And I'm probably going to start a war with people saying, oh, the Abrams is not that great, and all the, the T92 could beat the Abrams, it's like that. The Abrams is one of the is, is the best tank out there, in my opinion. Okay, that's just my opinion. I don't mean to start a war. You can voice your opinion in the comment section below if you want, but I'm not, I'm not, I don't hate people who like other things. It's just, I think the Abrams is the best, and the LC combat experience has kind of proved it. Okay, we got him screwed up, but he's going to be backing back down. We did breach him. That guy went to our spawn. Who does he think he is? He might be repaired by the time we get back. It did say breach, but I don't know how damaged the breach was, so... Hopefully we can get lucky. He's popping smoke, but he's directly ahead of our hole. Oh, and we get an assist. Damn you, IS-2, you stuck my kill! Now I don't know where I am. I'm lost. I need an adult. Who's being hit? Oh, I see a guy. I just shot him and he had no register yet. Somehow he was able to get shot. <clears throat> I don't know what's going on. I'm genuinely confused. I don't want to get my kills by camping spawn, but you know what? They do it to me. I tracked him only? Come on! He's so thin! And an assist. Why are they so thin? Who builds a tank like that? Damn British. Please that Piper armor against them. Are they thinner than though this is? Like, what's the fuse delay? Or fuse is on this thing. Um, what's the fuse? What's, where is it? Where does it say fuse? Fuse delay. 1.2 meter. No, that's meter. No, fuse sensitivity. There, it's 15 mother. Yeah, he's probably thinner than 15. There's still that booger that's never died. I just don't know where he is. Uh oh, I've been doing too much and I got my voice too high. Now I'm coughing a lot. Are right, people getting shot? Ice 3 has been hit. Uh oh. I hear jets over me. I'll see Act 15. We're good. Why is the Ice 3 repairing? Somebody's getting hit. Really, the whole reproduction has been sitting there the entire time. What are the chances? Oh, we're against Germans. We're gonna get hit by a Leo. I can feel it in my toesies. Oh, it hurts me. Not used to that. This actually doesn't have bad dirt speed. Oh, I can't remember how much I have an upgrade on that one. You're missing like transmission. Uh, is this the one? Yeah, you're missing transmission engine and artillery support. Why are they going so fucking slow? 19 miles an hour on flat ground? Yeah, they like limit you on most tanks in that spot. I don't know why. It's kind of that's rude. Not, that's not limiting, man. That's like full blown. <laughs> it's like, oh, there's a guy over. Shit. Man, 19 miles an hour. What the fuck was that? A low shot. I try to get revenge. And I suck. It's fine. The enemy controls most of the strategic zones. There's two of them there. I know they know where I am. I'm scared. Is there are you two five ones? I can't side scrape. Oh, you need to. They're heat ammo racks. What the hell was that? Oh. Did nobody else go? Okay, there's other people. Maybe the other guys will get distracted. It's M46 and IS6. Maybe they'll distract them. One can only hope. Okay, they're moving. Excuse me. Everybody's traveling packs. Two bulldogs on the team. Uh, one down. I don't know if it's the one that killed you. <clears throat> I, I did get one. No, not shoot me. Don't machine. I mean, that's just rude. 
Actually, if you could shoot that bush down, it'd be just great, dude. I have six again screwed. There's two Leos in the corner of the building. Look on the right side. Got their side view, I think. I'm dealing with IS6. At least one's a Leo. I'm not sure to that one. King Tiger. Oh. We captured most of the strategic zones. I don't see the Leos. Can fire? Where? Oh, right there. Oh, there's another one by the dust. And to the right of the building, where that guy's at. All right, kind of, you know. Yeah. Right side, let's see point is. They stopped firing too. There was a port or a tiger too there. I shot. Yeah, I had six. He's like, stop. I need this two five one to. Oh, he the artillery accurate. He tracked me. What's a uh, Russian for bounce? That's what this guy's yelling right now. He didn't care about the King Tiger. He's gonna mark it for somebody, you know. Let him know. That booger, tra that booger tracked me, man. Keep an eye straight in front of the hull of the I-6 to try to save him. I'm so. currently tracked and can't move. Well, I'm just saying. When you get a chance, there's something lurking around here. I don't know what it was, but shot a couple times. I think plans are very angry with me. Did you kill both of those? Or just the one? I killed just one. There's a Porsche right there. I can't aim this thing. Oh, I wonder if I should try to hit Sabo out. If we one more shot to the cheek, I'll try Sabo out. Oh, 103. He shot your carcass. What a butt. Oh, he moved his turret at the wrong time. Attention to the map. Pilot's pencil. Two gigabyte. Plus some bitchin' names. What the hell was that? Shoot the building? Yeah. You can't pen them. Oh, that was kind of a bad shot, but you can't pen them people with Sabo? No. Lower panel and anywhere in their chief. You can, every once in a while you can get the corner like the gun ring. It'll actually still go in, but. Why is this not. I, Tiger 2? Or I, I is 6 scared of him. I don't get that. You might get in and watch it. No, I'm side scraping like crazy. Usually they don't look Oh, why is this thing so low velocity? I don't get it. He got hit. All right, no, did he? Somebody's gonna fire up there. Or is it behind? Like behind oh, RE251's rushing. Got him. <laughs> Fucker! Dude, I'm up to four. I'm not doing bad. Never my voice is dying. Just like all the enemy tanks around me. I paid lots of money. I win. No, you do. You lose. There, I crave. He's on fire. Hit right in his cheek perfectly. His transmission there as well. How does it light him on fire? I don't think <clears> that's <throat> Can I his lower panel with this thing? Oh, yeah. Not if I aim like crap. Oh, there's well, a assist. APCBC or Sabo? <clears throat> APCBC. You should. Ah, he died. M103 got him. I biffed the shot. I don't know. Well, I only have four shots left. I'm going to go running out to people. APCBC, like, six months ago, was insane for this thing. 100. Yeah, I know. What last game I shot a Centurion Mark III in the the, uh, the blower panel. I kind of the right on the point driver only. It's like what? I know. Now it seems so. I don't know. I was going for a, reg a regular, no, normal what right there, and it came out all squeaky and high pitched. Still hmm. playing. I don't think I can. Fuck the radar. Use your massive, your good turret speed to beat everybody. Yeah. Double win with unrelenting, unrelenting force. I could have been an ace if that guy would have. I would have killed that Porsche. Everybody knows the Russians are known for turret speed, depression, and elevation. <laughs> and, fl and flat armor. Yeah, and flat armor. Anything to do with aiming a gun, they're good at. Not. I mean, this thing is actually incredibly mobile, and I really like it. I hate my 47 for that. I know, 19 miles an hour on fucking inch long grass. It's like a golf course out here. I was going 21, and I'm pretty sure there's a tank moving out of there, right? What was that? Oh, he breached me. I missed, I think. I biffed the shot. What is it? Are you 251, I believe. Oh. <clears throat> what? Yeah, I got heat. Flip, flip. Now my commander's dead. Now I have no chance of de defeating. Wait, what does an RE251 have? No, I was a man of heat, but they have Hash. Hash and Heen, I think, is it. That's it? 
Uh oh, and the radio's coming in. Wait, you got my elevation too? Oh, that sucks. Yeah. That 120 survived? That does look really close. Yeah, they did. Oh, yeah. Repair simulator. Object. How is it there on that thing? Insane. Oh, yeah, hey. Quellian. Yeah, Quellian. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll be happy. Don't worry. Da. I got 3251. How many teams did you get him? Wait, what M18? Is it M18? M18's dealing with a whirly. Oh, we got him. Didn't he? No, he didn't. There's Whoa. a Quellian over there. Where's the Quellian? Oh, I see the Quellian. Well, we're at least at the other spot. Machine gunner in transmission of the Qu Quellian. He's got three shots in him. There's Whirly. E1 took it. I got one shot left. Yes! Whoa! Okay. Two six two is through the side? Well, that's gonna do it for the video, guys. I hope you have enjoyed. That second part was definitely better than the first part. Um... D54, if you get the right map, they can do very good. And I, I really like them. And, uh, I mean, I, I don't like them. I like, I, it was it was fun on that map. Uh, but I, I've had too many other maps were not very fun. Uh, so, I guess uh, that's going to do it for the video. And I hope you have enjoyed. And I, I thank you again for watching. I apologize for my voice being funny sounding and all scratchy and the coughing. But, uh, I, being sick sucks. And, uh. Again, I hope you have enjoyed. If you did, please hit that like button. If you feel like you want to subscribe to my channel and not miss anything, go right ahead. And I will see you next time. Bye.